Hello, in this video, I will show you how to import the contents of my CRT material or CRT effects which you have purchased from my ArtStation store. So, I have a starter map in Unreal Engine, so it doesn't include any of, any of the CRT filter right now, but you can see that this folder contains the project of the starter scene which is opened right here. So the package you downloaded from my ArtStation store is this. So I will extract the content first. You can see that there is a folder named Advanced CRT VCR and you can see that it's a standalone project which contains the effects of this asset. So either you can use the project itself, open up, open the project itself, or you can just copy the content of this project into your project. So what you need to do is just select uh, the CRT VCR material under the content folder and copy these two files, which contains the uh, map of this filter. So I will navigate back to the starter scene and under the content folder of my starter scene, I will just paste them. So navigating back to the project I have, you can see that under the content folder, the CRT VCR folder and the new map folder is appeared. So I will double click new map and I will wait for it to open. And you can see that it compiles the shaders and opens all the content of the starter level of the project. We need to wait for the shaders to comp compile. And we can just copy anything from here to our existing level. You can see that post-process effect is appeared and also it's compile continues to compile the rest of the shaders. We have the screens. And all set is appeared right now. Now we can get back get back to our existing level. Let's see. Actually, this is not the starter map. Right. So if you want to use any post-process effect or the materials from the VCR filter, you can navigate to the uh, CRT VCR material folder under the content and you can check the materials from here. Either you can just for the post-process you, uh, post process filter users, you can just add a post process volume here. Let me relocate it. All right. And inside this volume, because it's only uh, creates the effects under if your camera under this volume, we can use a post-process material which I already created and added into this content, you just uh, navigate to the material part under the post-process uh, volume and we will add an element first and later we will select the asset reference and under that we can use the post-process filters included in this pack for example under the presets i will use the post process preset desaturated so i will drag and drop it to the post process volume which i created 
and it just affects the camera with this filter. So you can use the other way is just navigate to the stock map of the CRT VCR filter back. Let's save it. And you can see that we have and we have already some content here. One of them is the post process volume on the screen. So I will just select this and press Ctrl and C and then I will navigate back to my scene to paste it. But you can see that we have already a timestamp uh, which is projected right here. We can also copy this to our scene as well. So let's select the top folder like this and select the post process volume with control key and press control and C to copy these two content. And under the starter content, I will navigate back to my starter map. I open it wrong every time. And from selecting the parent item, I will press control MV. And you can see that we have timestamp components. Actually, it doesn't copy it, the child uh, objects. So let's roll back there. We open here. So let's select everything here and then post process volume. And now I will get back to the starter scene and select the parent item and press Ctrl MB. And now you can see that the newly pasted object is placed as the post process volume. Also, it reads the content from the timestamp generator, which I have here. And you can see the effect already generates as a post process volume. You can use any of the content by switching back to the existing scene of the CRT filter, or you can just apply materials or post process materials into your scene. For example, you can just use this on a existing mesh to work it like a CRT material. Thanks for watching.